in this video, I'm going to show you how to find the least common multiple, which is abbreviated with LCM, and that's the smallest multiple that a pair of numbers have in common. So you can take the numbers 4 and 5, and you could list out the multiples of each number if you wanted. So uh, multiples of 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, and so on. Or, you, and then you could say the multiples of 5 are 5, 10, 15, 20, and so on. So the least common multiple, the smallest multiple that they have in common is 20. Now you can use that method, or you can use the latter method that, um, that we've used for greatest common factor. And so way, the way that that method works is um, you pick your two numbers. So let's say we're going to do the um, least common multiple of 8 and 10. And so we want to start off by finding a common factor of both 8 and 10. So I'm going to start with 2. 2 goes into 8 4 times. 2 goes into 10 5 times. There are no other common factors of 4 and 5. So um, the least common multiple is everything that's on the outside here. Everything that's on the outside. Notice it makes an L. Um, multiplied times each other. So the least common multiple is 2 times 4, which is 8. 8 times 5, which is 40. So the least common multiple is 40. And then just to refresh your memory, remember you can use this method to figure out that the greatest common factor is 2. So the GCF here is 2. So let me give you another example. Let's do the numbers um, 15 and 9. Uh, 15 and 9 are both divisible by 3. 3 goes into 15 5 times. 3 goes into 9 3 times. Um, there is no other common factor of 5 and 3 other than 1. And we don't want to use 1 because it doesn't really help us get anywhere. Uh, so we're going to put an L around all of this. So the least common multiple is 3 times 5 times 3, which is 45. Now, sometimes the answer is not going to be, you're going to have to do the latter several times. So let's take um, the least common multiple of 18 and 36. Okay, um, 2 is a common factor of both 18 and 36. 2 goes into 18 9 times, and 2 goes into 36 18 times. Um, 3 is a common factor of both 9 and 18. 3 goes into 9 3 times. 3 goes into 18 6 times. Um, 3 and 6 both have another common factor, and that is 3. 3 goes into 3 1 time. 3 goes into 6 2 times. There's no other common factor of 1 and 2, so now we can use this method to help us figure out that the least common multiple is all this stuff on the outside that makes an L, so the least common multiple here is 2 times 3, which is 6, 6 times 3, which is 18, 18 times 1, which is 18, and 18 times 2, which is 36. So 36 is the least common multiple. The greatest common factor is everything here on this side in the G. 2 times 3 is 6, and 6 times 3 is 18. So just knowing that you can use the same method, you can also find that the greatest common factor here is 18.